How many great pizza jokes can you think of? Zero. Well, we got 150 right here. <laughs> Look at that pizza. He's going to eat them. <laughs> Pizza's going to send out for you. Yeah. Hilarious. <laughs> the table of contents is recipe for the perfect pizza. <laughs> <laughs> When does a pizza lover go to Kentucky Fried Chicken? When? When he or she is in a foul mood. <laughs> the first joke's not even about pizza. It's like pizza adjacent. Yeah. <laughs> They're like, we're going to get you warmed up before we get to the real pizza stuff. <laughs> what do baby doctors have in common with pizza store owners? What do they have in common? They both deliver. Started with their A game. <laughs> Her pizza's wealthy? No. <laughs> that, that's it. It says no. <laughs> sure, they're both rolling in dough. <laughs> Which popular singer was named after a pizza company? Madonna Mo. Is that, is that like a domino? What? Is that what that's supposed to be? Madonna Mo? I'm real scared that what is this supposed to be? Harry Pizza? Supposed to be? <laughs> Who is the pizza's favorite relative? Who? Aunt Chovy. She's a hairy fish, is that what it is? She's she's Aunt Chovy? That's Aunt Chovy? <laughs> yeah, that's I don't think that's what anchovies look like. I'm no. sorry. Looks like a hairy pickle or something. It looks something. like a dick. Yeah. <laughs> I have to censor it. <laughs> yeah, I can't show that. How do we know army drill sergeants love pizza? How? They keep shouting, Pizza Hut 2, 3, 4. <laughs> remember when they do that. How did Italy honor the pie? They made a leaning tower of pizza. Yeah, that's exactly it. Is it... By building a monument, the power of pizza, <laughs> brackets pizza. <laughs> Does pizza make people thirsty? Yeah. <laughs> we drink so. 150 mediocre pizza jokes. <laughs> mediocre is a little kind. <laughs> What did the customer say when the pizza baker told him, I put my heart into that pie? Never mind your heart. How about some pepperoni? <laughs> Never mind. What did the pizza joint owner say when the basketball team called to say they were having a pizza party? That's a tall order. I would think that a pizza joint would get many multiple pizzas for parties and games and stuff. So I don't think it would be that tall of an order. Yeah, but they're tall. Do you have <laughs> Do you have to tell these jokes? <laughs> no. <laughs> you have to be strong <laughs> to read these jokes. <laughs> you have to be strong to stay in the pizza pie business. Do you? Sure, you must be a good boxer. Because you box it. So they just like wrote down a bunch of pizza and pizza adjacent words and they're like, come yeah. up with something to lead up to that. Yeah. <laughs> it's barely puns. <laughs> I like that they had a picture of like a heart. Yeah, <laughs> the best joke. <laughs> Which comic strip hero adores pizza? Who? Popeye. But he likes spinach. <laughs> That's his thing. It's a whole big thing with him. <laughs> what is the best kind of pizza party to have? A surprise pies party. Who calls pizzas pies? Uh, those people that didn't know what Michelangelo was supposed to carry and he's brought in pies instead of pizzas. Like pizza! I guess like, um... Italians or, uh, or Mario's, you know, the pizza the pie. Mario's. <laughs> How many pizzas does wrestling champ Hulk Hogan order at one time? <laughs> Zero. He's like, 
<laughs> this could be some steroids. <laughs> Put the steroids in my phone, please. <laughs> this is really good, though. This is funnier. Okay. A peel of them. See, it's spelled like if you switch the E at the end, it would be a pile, but it's, it's a peel of them. I wish Hulk Hogan would leg drop that joke. <laughs> How did the spaghetti get close to the pizza? How? By using its noodle. It's noodle! <laughs> Why do golfers like pizza bagels? I mm, a hole. <laughs> yeah, they all want a hole in one. <laughs> How do reptiles order pizza pies? Well, the crocodiles... <laughs> That's not even a pizza joke. No one calls crocs crocos. <laughs> like, croco maybe a croc, but not croco. A croc the croco. <laughs> yeah, croco shit. What right is here. this book? A pizza shit. <laughs> <laughs> what do these reptiles prefer to drink with their pizza? I don't know. S such a good pizza related joke. Gatorade. The Crocos wouldn't, though. No. Just the, the gators. Yeah. You can't the go gatos. from crocodiles to gators. <laughs> what did the food critic say about the new pan pizza? He, he panned it. Sure did, but she panned it. She panned it. Was it was a woman who did <laughs> Why are pizzas round? I don't know. Why are they round? Who wants to be square? <laughs> So they can hide in a strawberry patch. <laughs> Why did the ghost paint his toenails red? So he could hide in a strawberry patch. So he could hide in a strawberry patch. So he could hide in a strawberry patch. Her pizzas, good showbiz performers. <laughs> of course, they're great. <laughs> What? <laughs> of course, and that's it. <laughs> what? <laughs> of course, they're great at entertainment. It should have just said, of course, and that's it. And you have to figure out why that's funny. <laughs> why do so many pizza parlor owners use prudential insurance? They want to pizza the rock. This must be referencing something I don't understand. Pizza. They want a, a pizza. Prudential that... has like a, a cliff or something on their logo. This is for all the Prudential I Insurance <laughs> nerds out there. Something like that. Can you imagine telling this to like a child? <laughs> They're like, what? <laughs> what pizza personality is faster than a speeding bullet and able to leap over tall buildings in a single bound? Michelangelo. Is that your final answer? Yeah. It's soup pie, man, you idiot! <laughs> <laughs> why don't they make olive pizza? I don't know why. It's the pits. Mm. But they do make olive pizza. I That's know. A, a standard pizza ingredient. <laughs> but they do. <laughs> they could have said, like, why didn't so-and-so like the olive pizza? Yeah. Like, why don't they make it? They do. <laughs> yeah, the answer, they do. <laughs> if you throw a pizza into two of the Great Lakes, how will it taste? Soggy and wet. Well, here's better. <laughs> Eerie, but superior. Ah. <laughs> what happened to the guy who tried to throw a pizza into Lake Ontario and missed, and then tried to throw that pizza into another Great Lake? He was shot and is really sad. Mished again, parentheses, Michigan. What do you get if you throw a pizza into all five of the great? They got all these great what? lakes. Did they is take it? a lake Keep vacation? These fucking pizzas out of the lake. None of these lake jokes have worked. <laughs> and they're like, we're barreling on through. Is it because the sauce theme? <laughs> They've already given up on pizza. Just, oh, I got some real zingers about the Great Lakes for you, though. <laughs> 
This is gonna be the good one, okay? All right. <laughs> what do you get if you throw a pizza into all five of the Great Lakes? Someone who littered in the Great Lakes. <laughs> This is basically one of your answers from before. <laughs> a wet pizza that doesn't wet. That doesn't wet. That doesn't wet your appetite. Ah. There he is throwing a pizza into the lake. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine him going to jail. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Because <laughs> the mished again joke. <laughs> He's littering. <laughs> <laughs> what happened when the pizzeria owner substitutes Swiss cheese for mozzarella on his pies? It was a holy mess. He said, said holy shit. <laughs> Apparently like it just like ate through the entire pizza because you can see his eyeball through it. Like how, how did Swiss cheese do that? Uh, yeah, that's not, <laughs> did he put acid in that Swiss cheese? <laughs> <laughs> what happened when the pizzeria owner substituted cream cheese? He got creamed. Inappropriate. <laughs> he creamed? Yeah. <laughs> what was the... Was that it? He got creamed? He got creamed. Oh, I see. Like, beat up. Yeah. They should have they put parentheses him. beat up and they explained put, all the jokes. He was killed. <laughs> he was killed. <laughs> Why do pizzeria owners resent IRS agents eating in their stores? IRS agents take too big a bite. Oh man, all those kids are going to be chuckling over those IRS and Great Lakes jokes. IRS. <laughs> That'd be good for the owners because they'd be getting their money from the IRS people. They're eating their pizza quick. Yeah, but they took too big a bite out of their, their money with the taxes. Uh -huh. Yeah. But, That's what IRS does. Uh -huh. <laughs> but if you take it literally, it just means they're eating pizza. <laughs> Why did Vanna White pour alphabet soup on her pizza? Because she's on Jeopardy. <laughs> <laughs> it's Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> oh, Wheel of Fortune. Because she's on Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> I'll edit that out. I said the right thing. <laughs> to make it letter perfect. Pizza <laughs> jokes. Oh, I'm, I'm thinking like Vanna White and Alphabet <laughs> Soup. <laughs> I bet they make some jokes like, take my wife, please, in here. <laughs> how can you get a job slicing pizza? I don't know how. Who knows? Who does? No, just who knows. <laughs> We're on page 18 of... 500. 64? Uh, Shit. Nintendo 64. Nintendo 64! <laughs> Pizza! <laughs> pizza. Might as well be. Let's have some of these jokes go. <laughs> Why was someone so excited about their pizza? Because Nintendo 64 was on top of it. <laughs> How did we come up with 150 pizza jokes? We went to the Great Lakes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. Hey. <laughs> I predicted it. <laughs> the future. Why did the man eat in the same pizzeria three times a day for nine years? Because <laughs> he hated his wife's cooking. <laughs> oh. Take my wife, please. He hated his wife's cooking. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I eat my wife. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the old ball and chain can't make pizza for shit. And kids are reading this like, oh, he hated his wife. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Take a pizza, my wife. <laughs> Why won't pizza sit in front of a restaurant? Why? They prefer the pizza rear. Do pizzas do well in college? Yes. Next. <laughs> this is reading like um, beyond belief fact or fiction questions. <laughs> How much money would it take to make you spend a night in a cemetery? Would you display this as a trophy? Do you have a pet? Do you have a sweet tooth? Do you believe in the power of a curse? Yes. <laughs> believe. <laughs> it's true. Like, Based on Hummings by Robert Traylor. Have you ever seen a pizza? <laughs> right, <by. laughs> right, right. Have you ever seen a pizza become a superhero? <laughs> well, Robert it's true. Traylon's Robert Traylon's imagined it once, so it was true. <laughs> what happened to the first pizza to complete college? I don't know what happened. Become the graduate. Yeah, yeah. 
When do dogs particularly <laughs> like pizza? All the time. They're fucking dogs. <laughs> <laughs> when it's made with mozzarella cheese. That's not true. Whatever. Yeah, but, well, I mean, most pizzas got mozzarella on it, right? Yes. Unless it's like, you know, vegan. But mozzarella, <laughs> that's different. It's like dog cheese <laughs> made from dog milk. <laughs> dogs eat their own shit. They don't care. <laughs> <laughs> it's a They're great idiots. Topic. They don't know. This is a drawing of one, a flying saucer, two, a lady's hat, three, the globe before Columbus set sail, four, a pie with everything on it, five, a finger painting by a child, six, none of the above. Oh, it's like a, it's like a question? Apparently. Was, There's no answer. It's not a, a joke. They're just saying like, <laughs> yeah. what does this piece of crap look yeah. like to you? Like this, I guess burnt to shit pizza. <laughs> <laughs> what is that about? Maybe it's one of those dessert pizzas with the chocolate on it. <laughs> I, I guess that wouldn't have mozzarella on it. <laughs> <laughs> Why do young people like pizzas? They're protein. Protein. Who discovered pizza? Christopher Pylombus. The Pytalians. Brackets Italians. <laughs> <laughs> Just so you know. <laughs> if one slice costs a dollar and eight slices cost four dollars, how much are 16 and 32? Mamma mia! 48? That's just a math problem? I don't know. I don't know what that was. Is it 48 like 40 and then dash A-T-E? Eight? <laughs> It's just a math problem? He's trying to throw math problems in here? <laughs> what? They've done this joke before. <laughs> Lake Superior. <laughs> this is the same thing. Are pizza store owners wealthy? Yeah, they're rolling in dough. Yeah, sure, they make a lot of dough. They should have said rolling in dough. Because they roll the dough. They do, but they make dough too. Mm-hmm. So. Yeah, but if they're wealthy, they're rolling in dough. Can a pizza marry an octopus? <laughs> you must be squidding. No. Squidding! That, that's not the same thing. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? Come on, guys. <laughs> hey, math problem. I'm just gonna throw a math problem in here. If a pizza gets on a train at 3 o'clock in the time zone, <laughs> then where do they arrive? Lake Superior. <laughs> Stupid. And that's where the guy's throwing pizzas in the lane, getting shot. <laughs> Fucking book. How do you know if your pizza can count? Ask it how much six minus six is. And if it says nothing, you know it can count. It was gonna be about like eating the slices or something. That's nothing. Why do they keep throwing math in here? They think they're educating anyone with this. Well, who, who's asking their pizza math? <laughs> this isn't a pizza joke. <laughs> this I really thought it was going to be about like how many slices <laughs> you eat or left or something. I'm just, no, you're asking your pizza a math question because you're an idiot. You say like, pizzas don't know math anyway, you slice it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> something like that. Jeez. All right, this is one that was on the back of the book. So they, this is like one of their top tier jokes that they used to, oh. to sell this book to people. All right. Would you use spaghetti as a pizza topping? Mm, yeah. Why not? It has possibilities. Mm. So this did not do well in sales. <laughs> we bought the only copy. <laughs> Most of these were burned. <laughs> it was the only bur book burning people were like, yeah, that's all right. <laughs> <laughs> like, actually, sometimes burning books is good. <laughs> Mamma mia! Sometimes it's better to forget <laughs> they, the past. They set it on fire and then toss it in the Great Lakes. <laughs> and they're arrested. <laughs> hey, Phelan. Ah. Why did the pizza guy go out of business, even though his pizza sold like hotcakes? Because it was a cake. His customers wanted pizzas, not hotcakes. Yeah. But, but, no. You wouldn't say it sold like hotcakes if it was hotcakes. Mm -hmm. It just doesn't make any sense. What happened to the man who claimed he ate a 30-foot pizza? He died because he ate 30 feet of pizza. <laughs> no, he just had a bite mare. What? 
in a strawberry patch. <laughs> so he could hide in a strawberry patch. Which historical leader was a great pizza eater? Napoleon Bonaparte. Bonaparte. <laughs> Napoleon Bonaparte. I changed my answer. <laughs> Clues. Attila the Hungry. Could it, uh, Attila the Pizza Hut, maybe? <laughs> <laughs> Is the pizza in this restaurant worth talking about? Talking about, yes. Eating, no. Uh, <laughs> Worst pizza ever. You take that, whatever place that is. You know they had some bad pizza and they're like, let's make this book based around <laughs> that joke. Did the knight's weapon come in handy to cut pizza? Sort of. Was that a good joke? Sort of. Sort of. of. What do mathematicians and accountants say after eating pizza? That was some meal. Mmm. Lots of math and IRS and yeah. numbers <laughs> jokes here. I bet one of them was uh, an, uh, an accountant. Yeah. <laughs> so these jokes are an so good. An accountant. <laughs> What's the best time to study pizza? Lunchtime. <gasps> what happened to the pizza that was sent into orbit? It became pie in the sky! Oh, just pie like that in the show. sky! <laughs> Damn pie in the sky detective <laughs> show. <laughs> what term best describes a pizza baker during the 1960s? What? A flower child. But it's the other flower. <laughs> like in pizza! Uh... And to explain that one. They didn't put flower parentheses flower. Uh oh. Which subject in school is preferred by pizza lovers who order meatball, pepperoni, sausage, and salami toppings? What? Arithmetic! <laughs> more math! <laughs> no more math! <laughs> what happened to the pizza dough that was shipped to North uh, Juneau, Alaska? Don't you know? I don't <laughs> like that. <laughs> Put it back. It's the only <laughs> one that's been bad. <laughs> Seriously, what happened to the pizza dough that was shipped in North Juneau, Alaska? They thought of two and they couldn't decide on what. They're like, we must have both. Yeah. No, seriously, what happened though? I don't know. Wait, Alaska. <laughs> <laughs>
You dumb bastard! <laughs> How would you not know? It's at the bottom! Bada bing, bada boom! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Is pizza a fast food? Yeah, sure. Yes, you can eat it on the run! This is just a fact, like, you can also, like, walk while holding a piece of pizza? <laughs> sure, yeah. <laughs> That's not a joke, though. <laughs> That's not a joke. <sighs> when would a vampire find time to eat pizza? I don't know, when? During a coffin break. <laughs> coffin crisp. <laughs> How much did the man who baked a 27-foot pizza have to eat to get into the Guinness Book of Records? The whole nine yards. He could have just probably done it and lied about it, or like just lied about it, and then they would have put him in the book with their money. That's how that goes. He started eating the pizza in second gear. <laughs> he knew someone at Guinness. <laughs> what do pizzas sing as they go into the oven? A uh, funeral song. <laughs> yeah. Home, home on the range. <laughs> do restaurants serve pizzas? Do fine restaurants serve pizzas, sir? Uh, I don't know, do they? Only if they wear jackets and ties. Oh, like, they're, they're the customers that they're serving, but they have to wear jack. The pizzas have to wear jackets and ties to get served at the, at the restaurant. I guess, yeah. yeah. Sure. Do pizzas <laughs> hate turkeys? Do they? They're gobblers. What? They gobble the pizza, I guess. Is it why do they hate turkeys? Yeah. You said do pizzas hate turkeys, right? Did I? Did I? I don't know. Um, I'll play it back. <laughs> do pizzas hate turkeys? They're gobblers. I heard yeah, it the other if way. If I didn't say why, <laughs> big foul on me. <laughs> By the way, why do pizzas hate turkeys? Why? They're foul! So they just did the same joke twice? Yeah. Why do pizzas hate turkeys twice? So they kept coming up with more than one answer to the same joke, and they're like, just straw them all in! <laughs> yeah, we got some turkey jokes in here. These we got some real turkeys. Just throw pizza in the sentence. <laughs> <laughs> what did the pizza parlor owner say to his cook when he couldn't make a pan pizza? You dipshit! You turkey. Did it just say you turn No, it? don't pan ick. <laughs> I liked your turkey better, even though it didn't really make any sense. <laughs> what did the insurance agent <laughs> What did the insurance agent tell the baker when a huge pie fell on her? I don't know, what'd she say? Don't worry, you're the chairman of the board. Board is still B O R E D. <laughs> I bet the board is spelled B-O-R-E-D. Yeah, they say this book is <laughs> box office poison. <laughs> Don't worry, you're covered. <laughs>to eat the fucking pizza <laughs> there's too many pages left yep what will we celebrate when pizza is 200 years old her death it's bicentennial parentheses bicentennial enough pie jokes <laughs> But it looks like P-Centennial, because when you put pi yeah. in front of C-E, it becomes peace. Yeah, the peace. P-Centennial. <laughs> also, I'm pretty sure pizza is well over 200 years old. <laughs> so great. They could just, like, you know, change this title, like, Pie Jokes, pie and jokes. they can reuse most of them. They're like, why is that guy throwing pies in the Great Lakes? <laughs> <laughs> Should you eat pizza with a knife and fork? Well, a knife and fork are hard to digest. Yeah. I like in the drawing, it's a stuffed crust, clearly. Oh, yeah. Stuffed See, crust. eat your pizza backwards. <laughs> Just like Ringo doesn't. Lad, the time has come to eat our pizza. Crust first. Good idea, Ringo. Yeah. Yeah. Stuffed crust pizza. Who eats their their stuffed crust backwards? All the people in the, in the comments are going to be like, oh, I eat mm. my stuffed crust backwards. <laughs> you save it for the end, because it's the best part. Mm -hmm. Those fools. Ugh. Why did the pizza wear red suspenders? The green ones broke. That's a 
joke. <laughs> it is. It's one of the great pizza jokes. <laughs> Seriously, why did the pizza wear red suspenders? Because it's going to the Great Lakes. <laughs> To hold up his pants, of course. Oh. They had... That's not a pizza joke. <laughs> How many times are they going to do the same joke twice? Because they're like, we're fucking out of them. We don't got 150. <laughs> we don't have that many that even relate to pizza directly. <laughs> they're like... Suspenders. <laughs> that or they were just too married to their material. They're like, we cannot throw away a single yeah. one. <laughs> Suspenders. How do we make this about pizza? The pizza's wearing the suspenders. Great. Put it in. The suspenders are suspended like my license to account. <laughs> <laughs> because a pizza is the accountant. <laughs> the bad news. A monster pizza is invading your city. The good news? It doesn't eat you. You eat it. Yes. Read! If you stack 3,000 pizzas in your cupboard, what would you have? A full cupboard. A large cupboard. I feel like I got that. Give me a point. Why did the pizza visit Italy's capital city? To see the Leaning Tower of Pizza. Be it ever so humble, pie. There's no place like Rome. Pies in brackets. What? Okay, you can't say that's... <laughs> it's a nothing. word pun just to, to say the phrase that has humble in it and then add yeah. pie yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what do pizzas fall asleep <laughs> lola pies yep <laughs> that sucks it sucks <laughs> what is a pizza's favorite expression i don't know pie's the limit They've done pie, pie, pie is the pie, limit. Pie. Do pizzas ever enter the boxing ring? <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> sure, pizza's been around. <laughs> Shut up. How did the thin crust pizza get into the National Basketball Association? It lied about its height. Oh, that nothing to do with thinness. But it's it would be short because it's thin. No, I just stand it up. I feel like there's many problems with pizzas trying to join the NBA, to be honest. Mm, but they're walking around with suspenders. Apparently they're <laughs> sentient creatures. What is the pizza's favorite Broadway show tune? Beetlejuice. 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 I'll give you a hint. Uh, Regis. Regis. <laughs> there's no business like pie business. There's no business like show business. There's no business like no business. <laughs> The giant Hasselhoff! <laughs> Can anyone improve on pizza as a food? No. This actually makes me angry. <laughs> How can anybody improve on pie fiction? <laughs> I was gonna say pie. Pie something. Pie fiction! What did the pizza eater do to the man who told him he hadn't had a bite in days? Pied him. He bit him. Yeah, the fact they had to say he, he was a pizza eater to relate this to pizza, even um, though it could have just been anyone. Yeah. I haven't had a bite in forever. Bite, that's the joke. Just calling him a pizza eater. Yeah. Is that... <laughs> Where do you put alphabet soup on your pizza? Because <laughs> Vanna White. Of Jeopardy fame? Of <laughs> Jeopardy. <laughs> Who is Vanna White? Not on Jeopardy. Not on Jeopardy. <laughs> hey, can you name three popular pizza toppings? Why? They already have names. I said no. Knock, knock. No. <laughs> if you're not going to play along, right, we'll just turn this okay, video around. Okay, pie is there. <laughs> pizza. Pizza who? Pizza nicer name than Joe. <laughs> this only works if the person you're telling this to is named Pete or Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine you contextless. You came up to someone and then you said, pizza nicer name than Joe. <laughs> like, I guess you had to say pizza nicer name. They're like, name do I know me. anyone named Pete or Joe? <laughs> what do you have to spend your life making pie? What? What do you have to? What do you have to be to spend your life making pies? A loser. Oven loving. What? I don't know. 
Oven eleven. In a pizzeria, if two's company and three's a crowd, what are four and five? Six, seven, eight, A-T-E. That's a math joke. Nine. Oh. You know what? No matter how hard they try, they're not going to get me to do math. <laughs> Would you date a pizza? Would you date a pizza? Yeah. You know, didn't everyone ask that sometime <laughs> in their life? Um, no. Why not? They're hot stuff. <laughs> Alright, you pizza fuckers. <laughs> That's why you got that whole pizza with the Swiss cheese. No! <laughs> That's what they think American Pie is about, don't they? Yeah. They've never seen it. They're like, it must be about the pizza pie. He fucked the pizza. He fucked hey. the pizza. <laughs> How does someone become a pizzeria owner? How? Well, bakers can't be choosers. I thought they were rolling in the dough, though. No, it's bad now. Well, bakers can't be choosers. <laughs> The time on the pizza clock's changed. <laughs> are pizzas good patients? I don't know, are they? Sure, they're accustomed to high temperatures. Do Italians hate pizza? Do they? Don't be so silly. Sicily brackets. What was the... Sicily. <laughs> what? Don't be so silly. Wait. Bracket Sicily. What, what is C silly? Like S I dash silly. Don't be so silly. <laughs> but what is, what is that a play on? Why didn't the pizzeria owner pay taxes? Because he hates the IRS. <laughs> there was too many pizza taxes jokes in this. <laughs> What's the difference between a six inch and a 10 inch pizza pie? Math. <laughs> Four inches. Yeah, we're at four inches! Does ice cream go well with pizza? How do you relate this to the word pie? <laughs> I don't know, what is it? Haven't you heard of pie a la mode? <sighs> to what reading club do pizzas belong? Pizza Hut Book Club. <laughs> the, the, the Book of the Munch Club. Mmm. Book of the Munch. Munch. <laughs> B-O-R-E-D. I bet the board is spelled B-O-R-E-D. <laughs> what can you say about most illegal pizza parlors? They deliver hot goods. Oh. Hogan's at them. <laughs> oh, I swear I didn't know. I swear I never eat that pizza. <laughs> is that right, Arsenio? <laughs> Drugs cost a quarter now, my man. <laughs> Anybody got a dime? It takes a quarter now, my man. How do you make a pizza green? Mix a yellow pizza with a blue one. It's a good color. <laughs> <laughs> do baseball players like pizza? Sure, they love to step up to the plate. Hmm. Why are there so many do blank like pizza jokes yeah. in this too? They're just trying to think of other things that they can sort of relate to pizza. <laughs> This one will get ya. All right. Okay. Did you hear about the woman who ate 12 pizzas a day for six months and didn't gain a pound? Yes, she gained 18 pounds. What? <laughs> Did I hear about her? Yes, she gained 18 pounds. Did you hear <laughs> about the woman who ate 12 pizzas a day for six months and didn't gain a pound? Yes, she gained 18 pounds. What does this mean? Oh, because she gained more pounds than what they... Oh. She didn't gain a pound, she gained 18. Eight. <laughs> Why did the boy want to marry the pizza baker's daughter? Why? Her father's dough. His dowry? Dough. Just For his dough. father's dough. Oh, yeah, he Just wanted a dough. dowry? Just <laughs> dough. Why did pizza jump off the Empire State Building? Hi. Because it read this book. <laughs> Why do undertakers eat pizza? Why? Because it rests in pieces. Pieces? Pieces. <laughs> what does it say? Pie. That's what it says, because it rests in pieces. Because it rests. Oh, okay. right, yeah. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> What's it really say now? That was it. <laughs> that was really it. I had to take a second to get that one. This book's too smart for me. What was the pizza doing at the Indianapolis Speedway? About 200 miles per hour. Pizza was driving. 
parentheses pizza was driving. <laughs> Might as well. <laughs> Who is driving? Pizza is driving. How can this be? Do pizzas taste good with shrimps? Sure. They can be eaten with people of all sizes. <laughs> Why did the lawyer refuse to accept the crooked pizza as a client? Because law pizza jokes are great. He was too hot to handle. Pizza law. <laughs> what instrument do pizzas prefer to play? <laughs> this is multiple choice again. Okay, like, well, it's not sweet. a choice. It's just multiple answers to the same joke. <laughs> they had 10 million answers and they're like, we got to keep them all. Get them all in there. Answers to the classic line, waiter, there's a fly in my pie. Certainly heard that first one in normal soup jokes. <laughs> How do you find a pizza that's lost in the woods? How? Go in the forest and make noise like anchovy. Like an anchovy, what? Make a noise like an anchovy? Because the pizza's gonna come to you if you sound like an anchovy? Apparently, I guess it's... Whatever. Why did pizza finally win its case in court? More law jokes! <laughs> because pizza is so appealing. It's barely anything. If you spill a bottle of soda on a pizza, what will it become? What? Wet. Just like at the Great Lakes. <laughs> You can't keep doing wet pizza <laughs> jokes. You can't. You gotta come up with new material. What kind of pie did the sculptor create? What kind? It's a joke you already told me. Pie a la mode. You can't do pie a la mode twice. <laughs> pie a la mode twice? Why don't pizzas go to school? Why? They're in class by themselves. <laughs> <laughs> what did the pizza do when it was delivered to the restroom? What did it do? Took a shit. <laughs> took a that was the best joke yet. <laughs> took a nap because rest. That's a great pizza joke. Yeah, you can't just take a normal joke and say, why did the pizza do this? Because <laughs> why did the pizza Why did the pizza do it? Why did the pizza kill so many people? <laughs> Because it was box office poison. Box office poison. <laughs> Why did the pizza cross the road to get to the other side? Pizza. <laughs> What's the pizza's favorite TV program? A what? Enter Stainsment Tonight with Mary Hartburn. All these kids in <laughs> Enter Stainsment Tonight jokes. <laughs> Take that, Mary Hart. Da -na 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 -na. Pizza! Guess whose pizza birthday is today? <laughs> got some, uh, some little sketches here, I guess. Lady, you've got a pizza on your head. What did you say? I said, you've got a pizza on your head. Oh, I must have eaten my hat for lunch. Can you imagine that on SNL? Well, yeah. <laughs> Which expression is a pizza parlor favorite? What? Dough unto others as you would have others dough unto you. <gasps> Should you eat pizza on an empty stomach? No, a plate is better. <laughs> How many of these should you eat pizza with blank, but then it's like, no, stupid. Yeah. <laughs> Try again, stupid. What happened when the pizza married the flounder? Everyone thought something was fishy! The pizza married the flounder. It could be anything, but yeah. the pizza the married pizza, the flounder. The pizza did it. Did the pizza have fights with the flounder? <laughs> yes, in the boxing ring with dough and pies. No, a pizza wouldn't hurt a soul. S-O-L-E. Seriously, did, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> How does a monster eat pizza? Hmm. By goblin it. It's not a goblin on this page, by the way. A pie goblin it? Or... I don't know. It just oh, because like he's a... a goblin. Yeah, okay. He's, he goblined it. Yeah, but it's like a dinosaur. Uh, what do you, how do you know what a goblin looks like? It doesn't look like that. <laughs> what does a goblin look like? It's like a goblin. <laughs> a goblin could be anything, right? No. There's no set look for a goblin. Yeah, they 
Chemically troll things, not <laughs> dinosaurs. <laughs> what can you say about pizzeria waitresses? What can you say? They really know how to dish it out. Oh! Where do you usually find pizzas? On a plate. Where you left them, stupid. <laughs> I hope they actually said stupid <laughs> at the end there. Do pizzas fall in love? Do they? Sure, it's usually love at first bite. <laughs> the end. <laughs> I don't need more of the song. Bye. Ready for jokes? <laughs> you want a pizza me?